Hey everyone, let's look at number seven. It says at a raffle, 10,000 tickets are sold at $10 each for three prizes valued at 4,800, 1,200, and 400. What's the expected value of one ticket? All right, so anytime I see some gambling here, this is a game of chance. I'm gonna assume I'm set up to lose. So my guess is A or D would be my answer. That would be my guess is that I would technically lose money because think about it, you've got to spend $10 to buy in and you don't have that great of a chance at winning. It looks like there's only three prizes, so most of the folks are gonna lose. But this is a, a numerical variable, but it's discrete numerical, all right? So my variable here is prize money. All right, so this is a discrete random variable. We count our money, all right? And I was not given a table, so I'm gonna have to make one. This isn't binomial. It's not saying you're gonna play this game three times and then count how many times you win or anything like that. This is just a discrete variable, and we're gonna go ahead and make our table. All right, and again, I'm gonna to expect to lose. When I see expected value, let me highlight this word. That's another word for mean. So I just need to find the average once I create this table. Okay, so it looks like you can win 4,800, you can win 1,200, you can win 400, or really most of the folks are gonna win zero. All right, and then we will account for the fact that you had to spend 10 bucks just to get into this game. We'll do that in a minute. So there's one out of 10,000 folks here, one out of 10,000 here, one out of 10,000 here, which means by complement, 9,997 out of the 10,000 are gonna get zero bucks, all right? Again, keeping in mind, we'll, we'll account for the fact that we spent $10 to get into this game in a moment. But I'm gonna go ahead and put this stuff in my list. I'm gonna put my variable in L1 and those probabilities into L2. So let me go ahead and pull up my calculator. Let me clear out my lists. And let's go ahead and start doing this. So I would have here 4,800, 1,200, 400, and then of course, oops, not 4,000. And then here is zero. And then we had one out of 10,000. One out of 10,000, one out of 10,000, and then 9,997 out of 10,000. Whew, there we go. All right, let's run one of our stats. Stat calc one, we're gonna go L1 comma L2, because our probabilities are in L2. So I see that the average is positive 0.64, okay? Let me go ahead and write that in. So here, my mean is positive 64 cents. So if you actually spent nothing to get into this, this game of chance, you would come away on average with 64 cents, but you didn't spend nothing. You spent $10. So really, the 64 cents you gain from this gets offset by the $10 you spent to get into this game, which leaves you with negative 9.36. Or if I write it with my units, negative $9, and 36 cents. So what's happening is each person that plays loses an average of $9.36. All right, because again, this, this raffle, this game of chance is not set up for people to win. Most folks are gonna wind up losing 10 bucks, right? Or again, on average, $9.36. It gets offset by the three people that win. All right, thanks so much, everyone. Bye.